guys I am back and uh, for most of you this is a second introduction and you guys are probably pretty surprised Hold on, let me get this all good you guys are probably pretty surprised I, uh, I changed the name of my channel and there are a couple reasons for this uh, first of all I have not posted in like four months and the reason that I did not post for four months is because I did not have anything to talk about and I I felt like I was in a rut I did not know where I wanted my channel to be headed and I think that I found a good, uh, a good avenue to go down. And I'm actually gonna. I, I feel so good about this avenue that uh, that I'm gonna be making a Facebook page in uh, and an Instagram page, IGTV. That's a new thing that uh, came to mind. That's why I started thinking about this. I was like, you know what? I can really make an impact um, now with like YouTube and IGTV and there's Facebook. You know that there's so many businesses and organizations out there. So. Um, that's why, that's why I'm back here is because I feel like there's a, uh, there's a spot for me now. And what Commander CivDiv means, which is my new name, uh, for a lot of you military veterans, you guys know what CivDiv is. It's a civilian division. It means that when you get out of the military, you join the CivDiv, you join the, the civilians that you once were, but now no longer can be. You will never be an actual civilian. You'll always be a veteran. And, uh, I think that's a big big deal to a lot of people um, a lot of people don't understand us we're different uh, nobody it does not matter if you're Air Force Marines it does not matter if you had deployment on your belt or not uh, most of us have a very hard time or have a have a struggle coming back into the civilian sector all right so this channel is gonna be uh, primarily for enlistees, which are people joining the military, or for p uh, veterans transitioning into civilian life. Obviously, uh, those who are uh, active military personnel, you guys are welcome. Been there, done that. Uh, you guys are definitely welcome. But most of the most of the content that is going to be on here is going to be helping those uh, those veterans out that just got out and they're like, what's happening? Or not even, not even just got out. I got out a year and a half ago. It's a pretty long time ago, but I like I'm still transitioning. I truly believe that nobody actually completely transitions into civilian life. I think it's very difficult. And I think that's something that um that impacts uh, that impacts us until we die, the day that we die. And uh, unfortunately, that day that we die for twenty one point six veterans a day um, is is today. 21.6 veterans kill themselves each day. These are people with no deployments. These are people with deployments. These are Marines, Air Force, Navy, Coast Guard, Space Force now, all right? Um, but it's fucked. It's completely fucked. Uh, and uh, I wanted to make a dent in that if possible. Uh, I know that's big. Uh, like, I, I'm not trying to be... I'm, I'm not trying to be that guy who has a huge ego thinking I'm going to change the world, but... I definitely want to impact that. I think that's screwed up. And um, a little personal side note, God, like the transition for me was freaking insane. I, uh, I'm still transitioning like I just said, but for the past, uh, the first year that I was out, I was calling the National um, Suicide Hotline, the Veteran Suicide Hotline, all of them. They all know me and my name. I was calling them once a week. God damn, like it, it's, it's a tough thing. Uh, don't worry guys, I'm not suicidal, but, um, most of the time I was just calling them because I had nobody to talk to, right? We all come here with different, we all come here with, uh, with different things on our chest and on our shoulders. We come with different weights. I was a grenadier. Some people were machine gunners. We all come with different weight on our back. We all carry different loads and, uh, we all need to come together. I think, I think that, you know, instead of separating each other, we got to come together, help each other out. Right? We all struggle with different things. But I think that I have a, a case that was particularly difficult just because I got out early. Um, a lot of you who have been following my channel know that I got out with um, some medical difficulties. Uh, I'll get into that later if you guys, if you new guys wanna, wanna hear. But um, I, I got out early and I did not have anybody to talk to. Everybody was on deployment and I came back and I was like, where's my group? Like, 
who do I talk to about all the things that just happened? It was a year and a half, and then just brick wall, and I'm back in Civ Div, man. It's difficult. So, I feel like with that experience, I can help uh, help veterans out who are dealing with this. Um, yeah, I, I, I'm excited for this. I think this is a new road. Um, another cool thing for you guys who are looking into joining the military, this, will, this is another good good place for you, just because I think part of the, the transition is, is letting out your emotions, letting out your stories, letting your voice be heard. Um, I don't know how I'm going to do this with this community. I think that uh, Facebook posts, I think, I think a lot of things, if we just, uh, if we band together and we just talk these things through, stories, um, we can, we can make an impact on our mental health. So that, that's the purpose of that. Uh, for you guys, again, you enlistees, we're going to be talking about boot camp stories. We're going to be talking about training stories, deployment stories, all that good stuff from different branches. Um, I'm a Marine, so I'll have, I'll have that side, but we're going to have a lot of different stories from different people. And I, I'm excited to go on a, I'm excited to start this. Let me know down in the comments what do you guys feel about this. Uh, let me know on Instagram. Give me a follow. Uh, Facebook as well. Commander Civ did for both of them. Let me know how you feel about this. Let me know your, your insight. Let me know if you're a transitioning veteran and uh, somebody who's looking into joining the military in the future. Are you active, uh, do, active duty right now? Just let me know. Let me know how you feel about uh, this whole thing. And uh, expect much content in the future, all right? Anyway, I'll talk to you guys uh, later. I think I touched on everything, so yeah, I'll, t I'll talk to you guys later, alright? Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> we got our tour. Inbound. <laughs>